Hey everybody, Steven here playing Subnautica Below Zero. This is experimental build 18822 here, and they finally have the second half of a crashed ship in game here, which is what we're looking at right now. So we're actually going to explore this a little bit today. Uh, I've been told that there's some PDAs that have information relating to the story, obviously, but I couldn't find them, so we're gonna try and do that today. I don't know if that's just because I might not be on the right build yet for that, but there are multiple entry points right now, or there were. One of the biggest ones is just in the back over here. And so we will just go inside here. And so far, it's looking really, really good. You're going to need to bring a laser cutter because there's a bunch of doors you're going to need to cut open. We just have this first kind of hallway, empty rooms. And then, in true Subnautica fashion, we have some like ductwork areas that we can go through to find other rooms. Like I said, this thing is huge, and this ends up being kind of the main area right here. Where we have some of the lily roots trying to grow on everything. So let's go down here first. And I believe this is one way to exit. So it just does a big loop. I don't think there's anything in this, no. this door and I'm assuming this is where they're gonna have like the control center right at least that's what it looks like to me so a lot more stuff is gonna get added got that guy <laughs> all right so let's go through this. So here's another entry exit point, right? I believe. Nope, it'll be blocked off, so this will just be like a hidden area down here. Now we'll just have to see what they put in it. So we got the cafeteria area. here yeah so this is an entry point another tunnel or ductwork let's see I think this leads us back to the top yeah so we went up the very very top ended up back here let's see so we got stairs there. This door right here just leads us to the other hallway that we first came into. Right there, yeah. We went that way last time. There's the PDA. Alright. Potential story spoilers here, so if you don't want to watch that, time to turn off. Mm, that's all it says. Alright. Code for engine room, admin office 6295. So, just like the uh, first game. <laughs> We'll need that door code. Right, let's go back through here. Use that laser cutter. I 
And I think right now the door to that just is one that I can cut open. Let's go check out this door. You hear the brute shark? So once I start ghosting around and using fruit cam and all that, you'll notice like this doesn't ask me or say that I have I'm low on oxygen anymore. It automatically does that now. Ooh, there's another massive root. Okay, so this is um, some placement stuff right there for when they stuff in. We have another yeah, entry exit point down here. And what do we got down here? Alright, oh. It's empty rooms. Oh, hold on. There we go. So I can see a little better. another entry exit point. Bunk beds. Which I'm assuming there's going to be a PDA in here at some point, potentially. Let's go here real quick before we walk off. Empty room. Beds, yeah. More buried bunk beds, and then that led us back to the cafeteria. So that's probably going to be the code. So let's go. We can. Well, that doesn't go to anything. That's outside. Alright, so that one's not going to do anything. And this was the control room, and I can laser cut that. Hmm. Wondering if it's going to be that, or say captains. Oops. Code for engine room. engine room to me. But so far it's looking good. I think they're gonna obviously add a ton more to this, but I think the textures are gonna change on this because right now at a distance you just see how it's like repeating. Certain spots don't look like that, like over here doesn't the floor really but that is it so I'm gonna cover a couple of things in some other videos later today um, there's been some music changes which luckily the music's been playing the whole time on this one but uh, apparently there's been new music added to the crystal caves I think the the deep lily biome got one as well Double check that. The purple vents and then the mining site. So we have the crystal caves, purple vent, and mining site got uh, new music. So I'm going to try to do some videos capturing some of that if I can. Or uh, I'll check Fabro and see if I can just maybe potentially play them. So that is it everybody. If you liked the video, hit the like button for me. If you want to continue to follow along with all of my content, hit the subscribe button for me. Thanks so much for watching.